Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to see how we can revert back to the stock kernel from a custom kernel. So let's begin. Okay, so guys, first of all, as you can see here, the kernel version here, kernel here on this room is the Borneo Island kernel, which in my opinion is not that great kernel, but I am having some charging issues with this kernel so i want to change a kernel so sometimes when you change a kernel to sometimes when you switch to a custom kernel then you realize that the stock kernel was better at that time we don't know what to do to go back to the stock kernel so today we are going to see how we can go back to the stock kernel so let's just see to it so first of all you just have to go to the recovery mode so i'll just show you the some steps which you have to do before installing a custom kernel so first of all just uh, reboot to the recovery here by pressing the volume up and the power button so as you all know how you can install a custom kernel by just flashing the uh, kernel here but before that uh, you just have to back up the kernel here just go to the backup option you it is in the twrp and also just click on this add button here click on add and uh, select this boot backup here uh, they select everything just click select the boot and just wipe to backup here take the backup of the boot here boot image okay so in the backup option as you can see this is the backup added here now when you flash a kernel you just have you just flash the kernel as you can see i am flashing the agni nusantra kernel here when you just flash this kernel here so this is the kernel flashed and now if we want to revert back to the stock kernel what we have to do is just install the backup here so i'll just reboot to system and show that the kernel has changed to agni nusantra kernel here so if you guys want a video on the nusan agni kernel here the, the latest agni kernel then please let me know in the comment section below i'll just do that so as the, the phone is booted and now as you can see the kernel is changed to the agni kernel here now if you are having some issues and you want to go back to the stock kernel the kernel which was uh, pre included with the rom then by the way the agni kernel here is running on this is the hornbill os rom if you still haven't seen this video seen the video for the hornbill os then please uh, there will be a card up available here you can just watch it and so guys if you still haven't subscribed to the channel then please guys subscribe to the channel and here will be the name of the telegram group just join the telegram group if you still haven't joined it or the link will be in the description below okay now i will show you how you can get back to the stock kernel here again reboot to the recovery here okay so now after you just you know we have take a backup now just click on this backup and just swipe to restore here now the stock kernel will be back the stock kernel will be back and now just click on reboot system now the stock kernel will be available here available so device is booted and now let's check the kernel here so as you can see here the stock kernel here is back the borneo island kernel here is back so this is how you can just get back your stock kernel or if you don't have if you didn't have taken the backup then you can just uh, flash the boot image from the rom so that is it so guys that is it this is how you can get back the stock kernel uh, revert back to the stock kernel so that is it so guys that's it for now if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to hit the like button if you are new to this channel then please guys subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions then you can ask me in the comment section below while meeting the next one till then stay safe have fun and goodbye